What's going on guys? My name is Sir Caro and today I'm here with another Feed the Beast what's, or tutorial thingy. Um, today I kind of skipped over a couple of things with factorization so I figured I'd cover them. Uh, pretty simple things but still need to cover them. So first off, with factorization there is a tool that you can use called a uh, pocket crafting bench. It's just a crafting bench that you can use in your inventory at any point in time that you need it and uh, you just right click it with it in your hotbar and then it uses the maybe it uses the uh, the nine right most sides of your inventory chest thing to uh, to create stuff so let me just put some crap in here so that I have empty inventory. Just move everything over here. Probably should have did this before. But yeah, um, it's pretty useful. Um, not it uses a lot of space because you know you can't have stuff in these spaces to actually uh, craft the stuff to actually be able to craft the stuff I should say you can only have these slots over here filled and it kinda gets you know messy so I don't normally use them but hey might as well have them uh, the next thing is a s maker craft packet Craft Packet Maker. And now, as you can see, it's just a uh, cobblestone, a piston, crafting bench, and some co more cobble. Uh, so let's just make one of them real quick. Did I put... Yes, I did. Um, I think I put pistons I had on me in there. And I'll get that later. Um, so yeah, maybe, if it goes... About lag. Um, it's pretty simple. What this does is it makes the craft packets that you'll you you can use to actually create other things. What did I do wrong? Let's try an actual craft image. Dun, 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 Why is this not working? Um, shape crafting. All right. Oh, fuck. I'm an idiot. That's why it's not working. I'll be right back. Alright, so I figured out what I was doing wrong. I was actually using sticky pistons. I don't know why I had sticky pistons on me, but I was using sticky pistons instead of normal, regular pistons. So, yeah. Like I said, the crafting recipe is indeed like that. And you get a craft packet maker. Now the craft packet maker just makes craft packets. Um, you can use this in your, uh, in your sorting or in a like an automated uh, automated line, you just put a certain item in here, tell it where to put it, and then put some paper in here. It'll give you a craft packet. Um, if I have some paper on me, I don't. Uh, let's go see if I got any paper over here. Run all the way over here. Hopefully we have paper. Why is the world not rendering? Some. Recording, of course. Uh, fuck, I don't know what chest it's in. Oh, look at that. Lucky guess. Sugar cane. Get 
get the hell out of way, away from there because it's laggy as hell over there. And then you just put the craft packet in the paper in there. It'll give you an unfinished craft packet. Um, then you put it back in here, put some sticks in, change the slot to there. Maybe. Gotta put it in the right slot. There. And then, you know, you can put a feather in there. Put it, switch it to that, put the feather in there, and then you'll have an arrow craft packet. Now the craft packet kind of automatically makes the stuff. You Once you get a full craft packet, you get a uh, stamp. And then you can put the stamp in the automatic crafting bench and the recipes right there and just keep on going down the line. So the craft packet stamper is pretty much the same except iron in the middle instead of cobble and nothing. So let's make one of them real quick. Maybe. There we go. Um, cobble. A uh, crafting bench. And a piston. And then some iron. And you got a stamper. Now, the stamper we used last season to make the, uh, the craft, no, the diamond shards for the uh, the uh, wrath lamp, I believe it is, um, to make the stuff. It's to make dark iron, that's what it is. Alright, let's throw those in there. We'll make a paper craft packet. And then if we put it in the stamper, I believe this will work. We get paper. So pretty much that's what it is. You can use build craft pipes to automate it. You just put put the stuff, direct the stuff into the um, stamper or the maker, and then out and then back into the uh, stamper itself. So it's pretty pretty simple. I'll be making a automatic some kind of farm, maybe an arrow farm because people always need arrows, right? So maybe make an automatic arrow farm, maybe make an automatic sword farm, I don't know. But I will be making something with using those two tools, uh, machines, I guess. But until then, my name is Sir Caro. Remember to like, share, and subscribe because you can. Um, not a big deal if you don't. I don't care. I'll be continuing to make videos for you guys no matter what. So, like I said. My name is Sir Caro, and I will talk to you all next time. Adios, guys.